Hey guys, it's Elisa here from the Why Book Goddess. So today I'm here with my July wrap up and August TBR video. And really quickly before I get into that, I wanted to let you guys know again that I'm going to VidCon this weekend in Anaheim. So if you guys are going, please contact me through Twitter, which will be linked below, or just comment on this video. I'm meeting with a couple other booktubers, so if you guys are going, please let me know and I'd love to meet with you guys. So on to the July wrap up and August TBR. So first, what I'm going to show you guys is the books that I'm planning to read in August. The first being Clockwork Angel by Cassandra Clare. This is the first book in her Infernal Devices series. And the Infernal Devices series is the prequel series to City of Bones. And I wanted to read this book because this is the only book that I have from her. And I wanted to read one of her books before I went to go see City of Bones at the end of August. So I'm really excited to read this series and I'll let you guys know how it goes. And the next book that I have is a sequel that's been sitting on my shelf for a while. Um, I really loved the first book and I can't wait to read the second book and that is The Elite by Kira Cass. Um, the first book, the selection, was really good. Um, I'm really sad that they passed on the TV show. I'm not really sure what's going on with that but I hope they pick it up because I love the book. And yeah, this is the second one and I'm really excited to read it. And the last book on my TBR for August is Still Star Crossed by Melinda Taub. I think that's how you pronounce her last name. And this is a spin-off from Romeo and Juliet. Um, if you guys didn't know Romeo and Juliet, the movie is coming out at the end of August as well, starring Haley Steinfeld. So I wanted to read a book at least on the subject before I went to go see the movie. Um, basically what this book is about um, is about after Romeo and Juliet, the two families are still fighting and the king decides that the only way to abolish this rivalry is to marry a boy from one family and a girl from the other um, and have like an arranged marriage and kind of try to put the families together. So this book looks really good. I'm really excited to read it and I'll let you guys know um, how it goes. And I wanted to leave um, the July wrap up for the end because it's really sad. I only read one book in July and that is The World That Trade Created by names I'm not even going to try to pronounce. Um, I had to read this for my AP World um, History class and I had to do a big project with it as well so it took up the entire month. Um, it wasn't even really that fun of a book either. It was really boring and I had to do a project on it so hopefully August will be a way better month. So thank you guys for watching this video. If you guys are going to VidCon please let me know. So I hope you guys are having a great summer and thank you guys for watching this video.